Today I'm going to show you a simple way of brewing exceptional coffee uh, without the use of expensive equipment. And we're going to do this by using this porcelain dripper. I'm going to demonstrate the pour over method. The first step is to bring the water to a boil. You're going to need about one and a half times the amount of water that you'll need for the actual brewing because we're going to use the rest of the water to prime the dripper and the cup. Depending on how strong you like your coffee, you'll be using 20 to 30 grams of coffee. And this is about two to three tablespoons of whole beans. Next, you'll want to grind your coffee beans and you'll be using a medium grind for drip coffee makers, which will have a texture similar to coarse sea salt. Next, you're going to place your coffee filter and we are using these number two unbleached coffee filters. You're going to take your filter and fold the corner and then place it into your dripper. Now we're going to prime our dripper and our mug using the extra hot water that we made earlier. And this will also help stick the filter to the sides of the dripper. Now leave the hot water in the mug for around a minute to allow it to prime. Now that we've primed our mug, go ahead and dump the water. Now add your ground coffee to the filter. Shake the dripper a little bit to flatten the grounds. Now it's time to pour the water into the coffee. You'll start at the center and move slowly outward using small batches of water. Don't rush it. This will allow the coffee to bloom and the process should take about two to three minutes. And now you're left with a beautiful, bold, delicious cup of coffee. Enjoy. Did you like that caffeine-fueled video? Well, if so, give us a thumbs up. It's right over here. And make sure to subscribe, and I'm going to tell you an awesome coffee quote. Don't worry, I can wait. Go ahead. It's right there. Yeah? You got it? All right, and here's my quote. Sleep is a symptom of caffeine deprivation. <laughs>